And welcome back as we are tracking excessive heat and dealing with these triple digits. It's not easy this time of year, especially when your AC stops working. News for Tucson's Javette Serato has more with one flowing wells woman who knows all too well what it's like living without air conditioning and how you can keep cool if the same thing happens to you. It was around this time last year when Jan Schutman was really feeling the heat, not only outside, but inside her home as well. Why? Because her AC unit was broken. She lives in a mobile home like these here behind me. Here's what you can do if your AC unit breaks down and how you can stay cool while you're waiting for the repairman. Jan Schumann thankfully now has a functioning AC unit, but in the summer of 2023, that wasn't the case. She ordered a new AC unit at the time, but the company told her it wouldn't be coming in for another five days. Schutman told News for Tucson what she did to stay cool while waiting for that AC unit to be installed. It was extremely uncomfortable um, during the morning, so I kind of keep everything drawn at night. It kind of got a little cooler. My air conditioner could kind of keep up. Um, but as the day went on, I would put towels on my head. I would have my fans. I would try to, you know, keep cool until I couldn't stand it anymore. I had a neighbor who uh, graciously, um, I went to her house for most of the day. In addition to some of those tips from Shootman, you can also take a cold shower, use box fans, and remember to always stay hydrated. Health experts suggest if you have to do anything outside at any point during the day, to do it early in the morning or after the sun has set. In Midtown, Fetzerado News for Tucson.